Hi guys and welcome back to my channel and as I'm sure you guys can tell from the title of this video, I'm the luckiest guy on the planet. Once again, my wonderful authorised dealer has called to say that they have a watch for me if I would like to accept it. Um, once again, it's a Rolex which I am just, uh, I just can't believe how fantastic and amazing our, my AD has been to me. I, I just feel so, so lucky. I never expected in a million years that they would offer me some of the some of the watches that I've been, been able to acquire over this last sort of two years. It certainly is. Anyway, we're going to keep this intro short. Um, you guys are going to come along with me to collect the new watch. I'm not going to reveal it yet, even though you've probably seen it in the title. And hopefully the watch looks as amazing in person as it does on videos. I've seen so, so many videos of this watch and I've registered for it the day that they were released because I've always liked the 31 millimeter um, of that watch in the ladies. The color of it just looks insane. So anyway, we're gonna get ourselves over to York, go and collect the watch, get some stunning videos for you guys so I can show you it in person. And yeah, that's all, let's go get that watch. Okay guys, so the time had come, it was time to make my way to York, over to the authorised dealer to go and collect the watch. And guys, this part of the morning is so exciting, the anticipation is building, you can't wait to see the watch, you know you're going to have it in your hands very soon. It's just an amazing feeling. So I made my way over to the authorised dealer and they had some cool models in the window. That green motif dial was there, there was a root beer in the window and then there was also a Rhodium Yacht Master as well. But guys, we are here for one thing and one thing only and wow, look how stunning that watch looks. I mean, the green dial is absolutely gorgeous. In my opinion, I feel like I've got the best configuration of this watch. The fluted bezel with the Jubilee bracelet and the green dial all just works in perfect harmony. Seeing the watch in person for the first time, it, it always takes your breath away. It was the same feeling as when I got the Batgirl and the Root Beer. You just can't believe you've actually got it in your hands. They look so, so good in person. So Danielle just helped me get the watch on for the first time to get it on my wrist so I could see what it looked like wearing the watch. And yeah, blown away. Unbelievable. These things always look better in person, especially under the uh, the lights in the showroom. There's something about those that just gives it an amazing shimmer. But that white gold bezel just, just pops. It just sparkles. It works so, so well. Um, so yeah, super, super happy with the watch. The AD kindly showed me a two-tone sub that another customer was going to be collecting later that day, which was really, really cool. So I got the watch. I paid £8,550 for the watch. Made my way home and got straight on the tripod to film you guys a video so that you can see the watch again in some different lights, um, have a discussion about the watch and some of the, uh, the features that it has. Um, and yeah, here we go, guys. So the big reveal. And like every other Rolex, the box is exactly the same. Unless you're going to be buying one of the platinum models or the um, the diamond baguette models, then uh, unfortunately the box is exactly the same. I think Rolex likes to keep it simple, which I'm all for. I recently bought a Amiga Speedmaster earlier in the year. And to be honest, the box was amazing when you first bought the watch. And then now it just sits in the back of a drawer taking up space. So I'm all for Rolex keeping the boxes simple let's see what contents the box contains. So we pull down the uh, door for the box and inside there is a number of documents. The first one is the manual for the date just. This just gives you information on how to open and wind the crown and obviously to set the watch. Um, it gives you a little bit of information about the date just in there as well which makes nice reading. You've then got your uh, warranty booklet. This just basically explains that you can take the watch to any of the authorised dealers in the world and they will fix that watch and send it to Rolex to get fixed if you have any issues. Then you get your guarantee card, which you should always keep with your watch. This has your model number of the watch, which is 126334, as you can see there. And then the unique serial number for the watch, which will match the inside um, insert of the watch um, to basically pair those together. So let's bring that stunning watch back into shot. This is what you guys are here for, I know. Um, so let's talk a little bit about this watch and how I was able to acquire this watch so quickly after its release. So guys, as I'm sure you're aware from the video, this is the brand new Datejust 41 2022 model with the green dial, the fluted bezel and the Jubilee bracelet. And guys, like I've said, 
think it's probably the best configuration of the watch that you can get. It looks absolutely stunning and in person it really really does pop so the bezel as i said is a fluted bezel that's made out of rolex's white gold which gives it that beautiful shimmer and shine the movement is a 3235 caliber now this movement will give you a 70 hour power reserve which is excellent the gmt master 2 and the root beer both have a 70 hour power reserve as well and i'm barely ever having to wind it as long as i'm wearing that watch within three days that watch will keep ticking the amiga had i think was like a 24 hour maybe 48 hour that isn't the case with the rolex movements they are built to make sure that you do get that full 70 hours you stick that watch back on you won't have to wind that watch for another three days so the watch also has a five piece Jubilee link. The links are polished in the center, which gives it that beautiful sort of contrast between the polished and the brushed steel. Again, makes it really flashy. Not for everybody if you prefer a bit more of a toned down watch, but if you do like flashy and you do like something to stand out, then the Jubilee is excellent. I also feel it is probably the most comfy of the bracelets. The uh, root beer is on an oyster bracelet. Whilst it feels solid and more chunky, it doesn't feel as breathable on the wrist. It doesn't feel as flexible. So I am very, very pro Jubilee bracelet and I probably would choose that over the Oyster on majority of my models. So the green dial, again, this has only been released on this model this year. So I'm absolutely over the moon that I've been able to acquire this watch so quickly. Rolex did put this dial into a 31 millimeter date just, which was primarily aimed for the ladies. If you haven't seen that watch, uh, there's a great Instagram page called Mr. Watch. He has a 31 millimeter and also this 41 millimeter and regularly takes sort of photos and content of the watches together, which is really, really cool. They do look identical other than in size, which is really nice. So if you were buying one maybe for your partner, that could be an awesome his and hers combo. So um, the watch was £8,550. As I'm sure you are aware, Rolex has put their prices up twice this year, which has resulted in the watch increasing quite heavily in price, making it a little bit more unobtainable for some people. But again, I do think this watch is worth that value. I think they're a fantastic build. They look stunning on the wrist and, and you just can't go wrong with a Rolex. If you're gonna be buying a watch to reward yourself for maybe some success at work or you've just always been saving and wanting to buy your dream watch, you will not be disappointed with a Rolex. So the, the value is still there for me. So we're just gonna get you some close-ups, a couple of wrist rolls so you can see what it looks like on the wrist. And then we will also now take a little look at a loom shot. So as you can see, the loom is super strong. Rolex's loom is fantastic. When you are in the dark, you, you the, the watch might as well just light up the room. It is really, really well done. And that's me just kicking the bathroom door open to show you the contrast between the night and day. Top quality production, as always, on this channel. So yeah, guys, that's, that's the watch. I'm absolutely over the moon with it. I think it's going to become my personal favourite. But that's the video guys, I hope you enjoyed this video, I do thank you for stopping by and subscribing to my channel, it really does mean a lot. If there is any other content you would like me to make, then please just comment below and I will try and make that. However, I hope you all have a fantastic, wonderful Christmas, and I hope that your AD calls with your dream watch soon. Thanks again.